Hello? <laughs> Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the J No Journals. We're back with another one. Um, today, we're actually gonna do a upper body dumbbell workout. So for everybody um, that wanna get a workout in that may only have a dumbbell at home, I uh, will show you guys that you can actually do a full upper body workout with only a dumbbell. We have multiple dumbbells, but uh, we'll show you that if you only have one, uh, that's all you really need to, to, to get to work in, you know what I'm saying? And um, and honestly, like anything you have at home, like water bottles, anything will work. Yeah, but we'll show you all um, a couple's workout that you can get done upper body, pure dumbbells. Let's go! Alright guys, like I said, before any workout, make sure you stretch thoroughly. We, um, we stretch before any workout we do. So anyways, so this workout, we found it online. So this is a eight exercise workout. So. The idea behind this workout is to get the full upper body done with just two sets of dumbbells. Um, so our first workout, as you're going to see here, is the bicep curl. So you want to do three sets. You take 10 seconds break in between sets, but three sets. After the bicep curls, we move on to the next exercise, and every exercise is done the exact same way until we get to the eighth. Um, you can find the description. In the description, actually, you'll see the full working sets and reps and everything we did in this workout. For the purpose of the video, we only showed one set each. All right, shoulder presses next. Oh, be sure. We got 20 seconds. So remember, keep your base shoulder width apart for that solid um, base, it gives you um, a good place to push from. You don't want to be too close. Nice and steady base. Okay. Let's go. So remember, we actually, we strength train at the gym, so uh, we're not here building strength. We're not here trying to um, get stronger. We're just trying to maintain our gains while we're, we're at home, right? Um, so. so we can use a little bit of Yeah, you can, well, you, it depends, it's relative, right? So the question was, can you gain strength working out from home? Um, it's tough because gaining strength is all about um, progressive overload, right? So our goal is to try to maintain and just to keep fit, right? Keep the gains that we made in the gym. So when we go back to the gym, um, we don't have to start fresh. So can you gain strength working out from home? Yes, but it's all relative. Um, you might have to invest in some heavier weights at home, but um, like I said, our goal is just to try to maintain what we have. And as you can see now, uh, we jump straight into the tricep extension. So the reason why Jay is using that five pound dumbbell is because she's not strong enough to do this with the 10 pound, or eventually we're gonna build her strength up to that. But um, this is one of my favorite um, standing uh, workouts. Then right after that, we went into some rows. So we did the inverted rows because the weight is light. So this exercise is easier than the regular bent over rows. So we inverted it to hit the lower lats. And because the, the weight is so light, um, we wanted to get a different um, spot in the back. Clean reps, baby. So far, my favorite workout. <laughs> so far, the AC is what is Right, so now we get into some chest flies on the floor. We do it on the floor because it's, um. well, this is part of the workout we found, but doing it on the floor gives you better stability. And as you can see right there, the timer. So remember, this workout, it's not like a three sets of a um, certain amount of reps. We're doing 30 seconds work and 15 seconds rest. Yeah, she Cause I, I was saying that the 10s are going to be heavy on me, she's just do the 5s, but no, I didn't, she's 
So remember, this is full upper body workout. So we're hitting every upper body arm muscle. So we get into the side lateral raises. And once again, as you can see, Jay is using the five pound weights. She's not strong enough to do the tens yet, the dumbbells. This is a dumbbell workout, but she's not there yet. We do have some five pounds that she'll be using going forward, but uh, she's using the five pound plates for now. All right, so this is a new one actually. This is one that um, I haven't done in years. So right now I'm trying to show Jay um, how to do this correctly. So what you wanna do is you're gonna wanna get your shoulder blades on the bench, so directly on the bench. You wanna keep your arm as straight as possible, depending on the weight that you're using. It might be difficult than, you know, than it sounds, but keep your arms as straight as you can, and it's called a dumbbell pullover. So you stretch back, and then you pull over right above your head on your chest. This one here will hit your lats, depending on how far you pull. Maybe the chest as well. It's a cool movement. Alright guys, so as you can see, we made it to the end of the workout. Thank y'all for watching. Um, leave a comment for what you guys want to see in the future. And, you know, let us know what you think of these workouts down below in the comment section. I uh, will really appreciate that. Remember to share this with everybody you know. And come back for the next one. Peace.